I'm going to show you how to split a body. There are many reasons you may need to do this. Sometimes you make a form and you really want it to be two pieces, or maybe you needed it to be different components, or maybe there's a cap that you want to have a lid on. There are multiple different reasons that you want to split a body. To do this, let's go ahead and make a body. First, we'll create just a simple box. We'll click on the ground plane, click on the origin, we'll pull out 50, tab 50, press enter, and then we'll go up 50. So this is just a box, and it's just a body, not even a component. So let's split this body. First, if you go to the modify split body, it says we need a body to split and we need splitting tools. Well, we could select this body, but then the splitting tools, we don't have any splitting tools. You see, if I click this face, it just wants to split it here, but I don't have anything. So let's make a splitting tool. You can use another body as a splitting tool. So let's do that. Let's create another box. We'll create it on the ground plane. And we'll just draw it here any size we want, as long as it intersects. And we'll press OK. Now let's click Modify Split Body. The body to split will still be this one. Now, when we click on splitting tools, if I click this tool, notice it's going to split it like a razor straight down the middle. If I click this splitting tool, it's going to split the body there. So we have lots of different options. And if I press OK, now you can see I have two bodies. Let's show another way we could split a body. We can also use construction planes. If I wanted to split this other body right in the middle, I could construct a midplane by clicking Construct, Midplane, click the top, then click the bottom and say OK. Then I'll go Modify, Split Body, What Body, This Body, What Tool, This Tool, and now it'll split that body right in the middle. What if I want to make like a curved cut in a body? Sure, we can do that. So let's go ahead and we'll create a sketch on the side of this body, and then we'll draw a spline. We won't worry about defining the spline 100%. We just want to have a curve, then finish sketch. So now we'll go ahead and click Modify, Split Body, What Body, This Body, What Tool, This Tool, and now you can see you can get these very radical curves going through the body, and we'll say, OK. So splitting a body is a very convenient way to make complex geometry. For example, now if I click this body, press M to move, and I pick it up, I now have these interesting shapes that I didn't have before. So hopefully you can use the split body command in Fusion 360 to split bodies when you need them to be in two parts. And you can create construction planes or sketches to be your splitting tools.